Hello and welcome back everyone to another episode of KSP Career Mode. My name is Corizilla and well, what we're going to be doing on this episode is trying to, um, just trying to, you know, rush through the beginning of the game. Um, and, um, I'm actually going to do this format for pretty much all, all my videos on KSP. Um, you know, at least if the design process isn't really that too terribly long, I want to show off the process of me making my ships and whatnot. But, um, but yeah, I'm gonna really delve deep into um, what I'm wanting to do with this series, as long with with a little update. Um, I'm gonna make a more complete update video later. But um, I'm gonna let this uh, this um, rocket launch first. And I will come back to y'all right after, uh, right after we um, finish the launch and uh, you know collect all the silent science and whatnot. And welcome to the launch pad. Now let's get ready before we actually launch here. Um, material studies, yes. Let's uh, grab that. Um, nothing else. All right, let's let's go. Do I want to get one from the air? Or can I... Can I get some goo from the air? Yeah, I can. Oh god, this thing is already tipping. Oh, fuck. Well, uh... Hmm. Well, as long as we, you know... Can keep it from not actually going like straight down. Um, and why are we in docking mode? <laughs> oh god. Uh. Come on, run out. Uh. Yeah, sure. I could. Uh, let's see. 17, yes, please. Alright. I think this is a pretty good science, a pretty good science run. I must say. Alright, now let's time warp. Till the bottom. Or, not, till the bottom? What? No, till... Till we hit the surface. Till we hit the surface. The ground, whatever you want to call it. The thing that we, the, the hard stuff that we crash on. <laughs> wow, this is actually incredibly slow. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's slow it down here. Goo? Ah, oh, yes. Goo, please. Alright, I think that will be it. <laughs> Almost 40 science. I must say, not, not bad. Got 5,000 back from that. That's actually not... Bad considering we spent like almost eight thousand. Yeah, you know that's pretty good considering we just use we wanted to use that for a science run. Um, what did we needed to get again? Um, I totally forgot. Uh, it's, it was one of these. Uh, yeah, it was this. All right, but yeah, we want to get the uh, general rocker. Rocketry, because you know that gives us the delicious more boosters and fuel tanks and whatnot. Um, but uh, we also have enough for uh, uh yeah, this last one, <laughs> not, not enough for uh, one of these 45 ones. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get this one too. And then we have eight more, 18 more signs left. All we really have to do is wait, um, 
wait till those are done and uh then we can uh you know actually get the missions where uh we can actually you know achieve orbit well and not exactly achieve orbit uh, at least uh um at least escape the atmosphere and i will go ahead and uh, get the uh orbit contract because once once we uh once we're suborbital um and orbit is not that far behind yeah, so, um, that rocket launch didn't exactly go as expected, but at least we didn't crash and burn. Um, anyways, oh fuck, I just, I did it again, I fucking said, um. <laughs> you know, that's one thing I noticed, and which I'm probably gonna also, to like, put in, like, annotations or something like that. You know, just points out how many times I use the word, um. But, yeah, uh... <laughs> Um, we, there, there I go, there I go again, I don't know what it is about me and ums, oh, it, it's actually starting to annoy me now that I've noticed it, <laughs> but, uh, we're, we're, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna design a new, a new rocket to get us suborbital, now, um, you will actually kind of see that my design will change from what actually is, ends up being here, Onto what you know you see on the launch pad, but um, but yeah, you know, because I do simulations, I now figure out that some stuff is just it doesn't work. Just some things you have to, you, you know, you just have to, you know, not go that crazy. And I was going a bit crazy with uh, this design right here, this initial design, <laughs> but but yeah we uh what my future plans are for this uh series is or what my channel is really um is i'm wanting to do two videos a week one ksp and one minecraft um i, I was gonna start this week but it wasn't exactly the best week to really get started on but uh, nevertheless we're um i'm gonna you know try to put out two videos a week, one Minecraft, one KSP. One of the reasons is I really want to actually play more KSP, and I just, I love the game so much. I want to, you know, build space stations and do a whole bunch of stuff I haven't done before in the game. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm really excited for this series, and, uh, you know, just can't wait to get started again. But I'm going to go back to uh, Pass Me for the launch. And here's my final version of, uh, of the Mark III, uh, I forget exactly what it's called again. What is it? Yeah, Mantis Jump, Mantis Jumper. I, I'm, my brain is so fried right now. Anyways, um, do we got everything up? Um, yep, yep we do. Uh, okay, yeah, let's, uh, let's hit this. Now, um, as you can see, my uh, initial design changed a lot, but that's only because of, um, but that's only because of uh, weight requirements, and on top of that, aerodynamics. I mean, the aerodynamics just changed so much in in this game. In this game, oh god! <laughs> like, see, like I'm already tipping over, and I'm trying my best to pull to pull back up straight I mean I'll be fine if we just go pro grade I mean that's that's fine with me come on uh. whoa Okay. Alright, come on. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, we need to get. Oh, God. I totally need to get fucking sub or orbital over this. I don't think we will, though. That's the thing. Let's just hope. <laughs> I 
Let's see, look at our upper. It's already 45. Uh, we might just squeeze it, but I feel like we we're gonna fail it. I mean, we had enough Delta V until I kind of screwed up on that maneuver. Yes, we made it into space. Just use the last bit to kind of flatten out our trajectory. Crew report. Yeah. Alright, let's uh time warp up to that point. Mystery Goo, thank you very much. Okay, good, yeah. I put the... I put the... The uh, heat shield on the right... Uh, on the bottom right there. Because <laughs> I feel like I, I almost derped up and uh, put it like right uh, right there in between the uh, service module and, and the science bay. Now, coming down the steep is, is really dangerous. I really wish we had a little bit more fuel to kind of flatten out our trajectory, but... Uh... What can you do? I would speed up time right now, but, um, I'm just afraid. <laughs> Alright, we haven't even hit a thousand meters and we already, ha and we already have re-entry re effects, that's actually good. Oh my god, land like landings now is just like so rough. There we go. Whoa. <laughs> Alright, let's uh let's time warp down. Five hundred meters. All lines, lines in the world. This is actually a really nice sedate piece. Oop. Mystery goo. Thank you. Oh, okay. Alright, I think that will call it a mission, mission success. Fifty, wow, 57 science, that's actually a lot. Wow. Woo!
And the material studies is what really got a lot of the science. Um, 5,000, not that bad. Oh, wow, 4,000. Well, wow, 14, what, what? Oh, it's because of all these little... Okay, I, I see. It's all because of all these little, um, things. I... So, um, with that, we actually have a lot of money to upgrade stuff. And, um, what I'm thinking on doing is, um, upgrading two of these buildings. Um, I kind of want, I kind of want to go ahead and upgrade that. 75. Um... That's also 75. Um, we could, we could do a 150 and do both of those. Um, do we have, okay, yeah, we actually have contracts. Um, all those suborbital, um, if, okay, if we actually build a, a ship cheap enough, that actually would be really good. Um, but we would need to have a, uh, probe core. That's the only thing. Um. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's... That's mm, fairly easy money. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, oh, excuse me. You know what? Um, that's another seventy five. Yeah, okay. We're going to upgrade the launch pad. We're going to. Upgrade this so we can have more contracts. And then we're gonna upgrade. <sighs> See, I would have six, 6,000 left. The only sucky thing is I wouldn't be able to go on EVAs. Well, uh, yeah. Yeah, that can wait. Alright, so now we actually have some upgrades going on. So, some really needed upgrades, and they're gonna take two of them. Are gonna take 19 days, and the last one's gonna take 33 days. Um, oh yeah, and also if I uh, if I forgot to actually sh kind of show off, um, I probably mentioned it in the uh, post commentary or the or past or the future me. Sorry, <laughs> this is past me. What am I talking about? Blah, blah, blah. Um, uh, but, uh, yeah, uh, ship, uh, ship manifest. I got that just because, uh, we're gonna have space stations in the near future once I actually, once I actually get good enough uh, on rendezvous, cause I, I mean, I mean, I can land and stuff, you know, you know, pretty good. I don't want to say, you know, I'm like the best or whatnot, but I mean, I can, I can land a lander pretty, uh, pretty good. But whenever it comes to, like, uh, you know, rendezvousing and docking and stuff, uh, and I'm not so much great at that. So, I'm gonna leave it here for this episode. Um, if you, uh, if you like the episode, can you please give it a like, and if you want to follow me on Twitter for live updates, uh, links will be down below. Also, link to the game and also, uh, and the mods and stuff will be all down in the description below. Um, to be honest, it's actually kind of there's actually a lot of links to actually go through because there's a, a pretty good mods, a pretty good amount of mods. The, um, the only thing that is kind of disappointing though right now is um, is real shoots, um, not actually, uh, you know, like the real shoots mod uh, is not updated yet, and that is actually breaking my game. I don't know if it's because of, like the new, uh, you know, uh, new physics to the game where it, real shoots is not needed. Um, that's probably the case. I don't really know. If you know, let me, uh, just let me know in the comments or whatnot, but, um, 
yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. Oh, what fun is there in making sense?